in the kitchen, I would not trust Dylan Strom to cook me a meal unless he's grilling. He's actually grilled a couple times for me, but you know, in the kitchen, he's he's probably not the best. I'd leave that up to his fiance. Chicago is definitely more than deep dish pizza. Yo, it looks different. What do you think? From a food perspective, uh, Chicago is considered the culinary capital of the United States. Delicious or impressive? Delicious is impressive. I love the Chicago food scene, and that's something I want to show you guys here today, and I just love it here. I'm Alex Dabrinkit, I'm a hockey player, and I'm going to put you on to Chicago. Hey guys, welcome to Chicago. I'm going to put you on to a couple of my favorite spots in the city. To start the day off, we're going to get some coffee. Let's go. I came to the Chicagoland suburbs when I was in high school. You know, I got a little sneak peek of the city being able to come here to play. It was a dream come true. Thank you. Do you think I can get a chocolate chip cookie too, please? Yeah, of course. Yeah, growing up in, in Michigan was not too much of a change to come here. Uh, I was first introduced to hockey by my brother and my dad. I think I fell in love with just the competitive nature of, of hockey and how fast it is and you know that's kind of what really drew me to the game. We're gonna finish up this cup of coffee and then I'm gonna take you over to Manny's, a place that my teammates always talk about and um, somewhere I've been meaning to try and uh, get their corned beef sandwich. No, my diet's probably not very good. I don't really keep track of anything. I could probably make a, a better effort at that, but um, right now I just like food too much to cut some stuff out. Hey Alex, welcome to Manny's. Hey, I've heard great things about the corned beef sandwich, but um, you think you could walk me through some of this and uh, I can try some stuff? Yeah, so we're actually really well known for all our hot entrees as well. Everything's prepared fresh here. So this is our beef stew. It's one of my favorites. And then we come down here to our giant turkey legs, always a fan favorite. And then uh, we have our knishes. It's ground beef and onion in the inside and then mashed potato on the outside. And then we put some beef gravy right on top. So Sounds delicious. Let me give you one of those. Oh yeah, that looks great. And then we keep moving down. Uh, we're a Jewish deli, so what's a Jewish deli without some great matzo ball soup? So, uh, All right, let's try it. Here you go, we'll give you some matzo ball soup. I have not tried matzo ball soup before. Um, we'll see how it goes. And then we head down here to our corned beef. That's what we're most known for, most famous for since 1942. So we're gonna turn on the slicer to get some fresh meat going. Uh, about how many pounds of meat is that? It's about three quarters of a pound. Is rye bread okay? Yeah, that's great. Great. We're gonna pile it high. This is what we've all been waiting for. And I always suggest to top it off with a potato pancake. All right, let's do it. There you go. Thank you. Yo, family's up. We're a fourth generation business here in Chicago. Uh, now I've been here for 15 years, so I'm keeping the Chicago tradition alive and uh, we'll hopefully be here for another 80 years. All right, let's dive in. This looks unbelievable right here. That's awesome. Mustard goes so good with it. Best corned beef sandwich I've ever had. So in Chicago, you have so many different price points where you can eat at. And I like my fancy restaurants, but coming here to Manny's today, this is great food. And I'm definitely coming back. Growing up, I was always so picky. And so, um, you know, one thing I've not tried is this potato pancake. So I'm going to give that a try right now. That's really good. Didn't know what to expect, but texture's like a fried. I don't know, fried pancake, I guess. It's got a little bit of salt to it, and it's pretty awesome. I mean, I didn't know what to expect, so I can't really say I expected anything, but this is great. If I had to take a teammate here, I would probably choose Dylan Strom. He loves all kinds of food, so he would really enjoy this place and really just feast. This is really good. It kind of reminds me of like something my grandma would make um, when I would go over to her house. So um, yeah, this is awesome. What is this called? Matzo ball. A matzo ball? This is spoon, right? Am I supposed to like take that much? Yeah, that's that's good. It's got like a chicken noodle soup broth, but yeah, the matzo ball in the, in the middle, and this is great. You know, hanging out and bonding is, is always important to a, a team game, and food definitely acts as a bonding mechanism. I mean, team chemistry is everything, I think, 
the way you work on the ice together obviously has a big effect on the game and you know I think a lot of that chemistry comes from off the ice and how close you are as a team. Watch your back. Order! You cut vegetables like a bitch. So sorry guys. You got no idea what you're doing here. Is my hair on fire? Uh, not yet, no. I mean, we have Manny's, like one of the best delis ever. A lot of people don't think about delis when they think about Chicago, but Manny's is a, it's a staple. If I was to tell someone to order something from Manny's, it would be the corned beef sandwich with a potato pancake. It's unbelievable. Literally melts in the mouth. This is my first time at Manny's. I have heard about it for years, uh, having lived in Chicago, but I never made it down here. and. I feel like it's a Chicago staple everybody needs to try, so I'm really happy I'm getting to try it today. Kanish is something I would tell somebody to come here for. Um, I like the matzo ball soup too, though. I've been coming to Manny's for about 15 years now. There's not many places that have good corned beef like this, and uh, the customer service is amazing here as well. Family restaurants are a part of what built this city. You know, you can't have places like Manny's go away um, because they're just such an important part of the city. I want you to come to Chicago for the food, the people, the sports. There's just a great list of things to see here and do, and that's why it's home to me. Thank you guys and FX is the Bear for letting me show you around some of my favorite spots in Chicago. If you want to see more of my favorite city, you can watch FX is the Bear, now streaming only on Hulu.